The Yamaha Aerox 155 looks fast even when standing still thanks to its edgy design language. When viewed from the front, the aggressive split LED headlamps fitted into this seemingly large front end, would surely catch your eye. The design has a lot going on, yet looks appealing. As you'd notice, the Aerox 155 is not your regular scooter. And neither is the process of getting on it. Unlike scooters where you step through, the Aerox sports an underbone chassis and you'd get on it like you would on a motorcycle. It feels a bit unnatural at first, and I did end up getting off the regular way a couple of times. You know Adad Se Majboor and all that. But this spine as it is called wouldn't take time getting used to. Yes, grocery runs are gone for a toss but you could grip onto it like a fuel tank. Now that's something I liked, having said that, the available floor space is enough to move your feet freely and does not feel as cramped as it looks. Now, the seating ergos are almost similar to a motorcycle. It gets a wide handlebar that is close to the rider and an upright riding position. The Aerox 155 is something that would have your attention the moment to set eyes on it. It is something that would appeal to you if you want to stand out in a crowd. And once you ride it, it's hard not to contemplate getting one home. The scooter feels premium, the engine refined all through and when you want to twist the throttle and just go for it, that impressive motor has your back. That said, it is also easy to handle and have fun with on corners or in traffic. Yes, the lack of floorboard space might concern a few, but the scooter makes up for it with massive boot space. However, I wished it came with better brakes and slightly plusher ride quality. If you like our videos, don't forget to subscribe and activate notification. You can also follow our Facebook page for detailed pictures.